This is a sleepy corner of Brooklyn Park, which is why we chose it. <laughs> we have a beautiful pond in our backyard and wildlife and deer and we were so excited about all of that. As a husband and wife realtor team, Jen and Jeff Geisinger built their own home. A dream they fear will soon end with a glance out their front door. Big concrete box with lots and lots of trucks and lots of cars. And lots of lights and yep. lots of noise. Across from their neighborhood, empty land slated for development sits between the Twin Cities corn maze <laughs> and the North Park Business Park. Progress is good, jobs are good. We want things like that for our community. But according to these Brooklyn Park Planning Commission records, the Geisingers thought a large distribution facility would not be permitted here. Well, anybody I've talked to in the real estate world uh, has said this is distribution on steroids. We do feel like we were sort of sold a bill of goods. The city of Brooklyn Park recently held an open house telling neighbors about a developer's proposed change. Scannell Properties plan to build a 2.6 million square foot fulfillment center. It's a four story building. A building for a mystery tenant. And of course, Brooklyn Park is calling it Project Hot Dish. I call it Project Hot Mess, but that's just a personal opinion. And a surprise to RJ Theo. He sits on the planning commission for the nearest neighbor of Champlin. What we have is the potential for 250 semi trucks a day pulling through this area that's not getting any expansion on a highway or major road. A potential for a thousand plus employees, meaning 2,000 car trips a day, that's gonna be a problem. It's not very neighborly. While Amazon isn't commenting on any plans for Minnesota, Jen is prepared to fight the possibility. She's visited the Shakopee Fulfillment Center, even created a website and is educating her neighbors about dreams that may now be unfulfilled. When I said, you guys, it's too late. Like your values are going down as we speak because everybody knows this is proposed. Everybody knows this is a concern. From a realtor standpoint, it's devastating. In Brooklyn Park, Lindsay Sievert, CARE 11 News. Well, as Lindsay mentioned, Amazon is not yet commenting on specific plans in Minnesota, but told CARE 11 it is constantly investigating new locations to support the growth and increase the flexibility of its North American network to address customers' needs. Well, the City of Brooklyn Park Planning Director Cindy Sherman told CARE 11, we are not being secretive. It doesn't matter who the end user is if we have traffic studies, noise analysis, rules and regulations being met. And by the way, that Planning Commission meeting is tonight at 7 at Brooklyn Park City Hall. A